rishi mushroom rishi mushroom is a uh, medicinal mushroom why i say it's specifically medicinal mushroom because uh, the taste of rishi mushroom or the ganoderma is very bitter uh, you can't just directly consume or chew it it's very bitter and harsh in uh, taste but it's amazing for our health it's an immunity immunity booster and often referred as the mushroom of immortality that's the reason the capsules or the tinctures or other extract things from the rishi mushroom has very high demand in the market so incubation uh, temperature is 21 to 32 degree and the fruiting temperature is 15 to 35 so it's again a moderate uh, temperature uh, mushroom rishi mushroom or the ganoderma mushroom uh, both are same so uh, this mushroom uh, is quite easy to grow it can be grown on a wide varieties of sawdust saw not only on hardwood we have tried it on softwood as well it have performed well we have uh, tried it on mixed varieties of sawdust again it performed well so i find it one of the most easiest and uh, profitable mushrooms to grow okay the rishi mushroom button mushroom agaricus visporus uh, this mushroom variety needs no introduction this is one of the most popular and uh, most grown mushroom and commercialized in uh, the world all over india and world there are commercial farms which is producing tons of this variety of mushroom the fruiting temperature is low so it's not easy for a normal grower to maintain 16 to 18 degree temperature uh, unless it is a winter climate area and the incubation temperature is 23 to 25 degrees celsius button mushrooms uh, may some, uh, the main difficulty in mush button mushroom is not the temperature only it's the compost it won't grow directly on any simple substrate like if you feed it direct sawdust or just uh, the paddy straw it won't grow on that because it needs decomposed compost it needs specialized compost with proper uh, nitrogen pro proper phosphorus uh, proper potassium in it so for that you will need uh, need to have a special composting area or a composting formula which you need to implement and at least 22 to 27 days it takes to grow uh, to make a perfect compost if you have a nominal setup so this is the button mushroom then the shiitake mushroom uh, by the end of this uh, today's webinar definitely uh, i will tell you where to find all these materials from where you will be able to take the reference of, of these temperatures so uh, even in, if you want to grow button mushroom what's the chemicals used in this what's the uh, what are the uh, methods of compost preparation all those materials you will get but for the sake of the webinar, I am keeping it short because we will be discussing more on the other essential items uh, on the topics which had not been covered in the previous webinars. Okay. I'm just explaining all these points uh, for the newcomers. Shiitake mushroom, one of the most highly shout after mushroom among you. And uh, uh, in the whole world, it is like either in the top or in the second most grown mushroom all over the world. Uh, right now, China is producing it most and India is importing it one of the most uh, that's a tragedy, but we as a farmer can always grow this mushroom. Uh, shiitake mushrooms uh, fruiting temperature is generally uh, 5 degree to 29 degree Celsius, but this is the ideal range 16 to 18 degree Celsius fruiting temperature is optimal, but there are different different strains of the shiitake mushrooms. Few can be grown in a lower range, few can be grown in mid moderate and few can be grown in the higher range. Okay, and what about the incubation temperature? It's generally around 21 to 27 degrees Celsius. If you are not familiar about incubation temperature, incubation phase, uh, fruiting phase, don't worry. Further, I'm going to explain it all to you. So shiitake mushroom can be easily gro grown on any hard wood sawdust. Okay. If you want to have a commercial farm, you can either use uh, sawdust pellets or wood chips of course it can be grown on uh, logs but logs will take a lot of time much more time than the sawdust or the pellets so it is better and preferable to uh, grow on those uh, those things only and it can be grown in indoor as well as outdoor uh, climate so hardwood uh, sawdust like uh, teak uh, oak these kind of plants are suitable for it it's uh, uh, hardwood uh, again it needs to be fresh it should not be previously con contaminated or very old lying in the forest otherwise uh, there might be other infestation in the wood so shiitake mushroom have a very high demand and the demand is generally in the raw form in the marketing section we will be discussing about it inoki mushroom the flamulina valutifus again one of the very popular mushroom and uh, uh, highly imported in india from uh, the asian countries it's 
it's also known as winter mushroom because why the temperature is generally 10 to 16 degree it can withstand quite harsh weather and again it's easy to grow the main thing is just you need to maintain the low temperature we have been uh, successful uh, uh, experimented it by growing inside the fridge as well so as as the main name refers this mushroom can also be grown in fridge indoor conditions or if you make a freezer chilled room where the temperature is quite low it can be grown uh, incubation temperature is in moderate one 21 to 24 degrees celsius and inoki mushroom grows on hardwood hardwood only okay hardwood sawdust maitake mushroom again it's a medicinal mushroom and as well as gourmet mushroom the griffola frondosa its incubation temperature is 21 to 24 degrees celsius 10 to 16 degrees celsius it, it's fruiting temperature this mushrooms uh, medicinal properties really highly sought after uh, one of the most amazing mushroom out there uh, known for its curable uh, uh, disease curable properties and highly immunity boosting properties this mushroom uh, is often imported but quite easy to grow you can try it and you you can uh, grow it yourself uh, have very good market demand because the supply is quite low and maitake mushroom is also a delicious mushroom you can also uh, prepare it just like any other mushroom the lion's mane mushroom again one of the uh, highly sought after medicinal as well as gourmet mushroom this mushroom is delicious in taste uh, but the medicinal property also makes it, uh, the, it there are several names with which the lion's mane mushroom is called it's also known as brain boosting mushroom or the brain mushroom uh, so the lion's mane mushrooms fruiting temperature is 16 to 21 degrees celsius but there are few strains which will perform better in the lower temperature few in higher temperature like 25 degrees celsius but this is the optimal temperature the incubation temperature is again 21 to 25 degrees celsius so this is one of the most profitable mushroom as uh, the demand is quite high it can be sold in fresh as well as dried form and several of the extracts tinctures capsules powders are taken out from this mushroom and sold in the market. Cordyceps militaris mushroom. Uh, this is a medicinal mushroom. Uh, the fruiting temperature is 16 to 24 degrees Celsius and the incubation temperature is 20 to 22 degrees Celsius. This mushroom uh, will not grow in normal comp uh, normal substrate. It needs generally brown rice as its uh, base substrate, but there are other formulas as well. Brown rice needs to be enriched with a liquid which is uh, full of nutrition, vitamins, uh, peptones, yeast, etc. And then once you produce this, uh, the base, you can see this is the substrate, then you need to inculcate it with the culture, the liquid culture of the cordyceps militaris uh, mycelium, then it will grow inside the bottle. Okay, so this mushroom can be grown in a quite a small lab setup kind of area inside the jars. And uh, even though the price range is quite high, the demand is quite high, but I won't say that it is quite difficult and very costly mushroom. You can definitely grow it. All you need is this proper knowledge. So whatever varieties of mushroom which we have seen till now, among them there is another mushroom. You can see the wood ear mushroom, uh, the black fungus also it is known. You can search in Amazon, Flipkart or any other website. This mushroom is really very highly sought after and uh, it has even uh, like the demand for this mushroom is growing day by day as uh, it, this is a very delicious as well as medicinal mushroom. Uh, it is no, uh, popular due to its crunchy and like crunchy, crickly, crackly taste, uh, consistent taste. It can be used with a, light, a lot of varieties of cuisines as well as salads. So fruiting temperature is quite basic, 20 to 28 degrees Celsius, as well as incubation temperature is 24 to 29 degrees Celsius. So just like oyster mushrooms, this can also be grown. They prefer sawdust, hardwood sawdust mainly they prefer. And they are one of the highly sought after mushroom and easy to grow. You can consider growing them as well. So these were all the varieties of mushroom generally or normally being cultivate, cultivated. And you can choose among them, but there are several other varieties of mushroom as well, as each and every variety of mushroom have their internal other other varieties of strain as well. You can choose among them. But these are one of the uh, whatever mushrooms we discussed, these are just few of the most popular mushroom right now in India, at least, which people are growing. So mushroom cultivation, let's summarize it. In order to grow mushroom, what are the basic things you need? 